Our work in advocacy is really characterized by leadership roles the American Heart Association plays in moving policy at the federal, state, and local level. At the federal level, for many, many years, the cornerstone of our advocacy agenda has been our work in increasing funding for the National Institutes of Health, for the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, and other federal agencies who are charged with protecting the nation's health. We also work on very important policies as well as legislative agendas in the area of tobacco control, nutrition, rural health, and many, many other things at the federal level that help us achieve our goals. In states and communities throughout this country, we're working on important activities like increasing tobacco tax, making sure that every American has access to clean indoor air, reducing sodium from the food supply, increasing the access of Americans to healthy foods and healthy places to exercise. We want to be sure that every child graduates from high school knowing CPR, and we also want to be sure that kids have access to physical education and physical activity in the schools. These are just some of the many, many ways the American Heart Association is working to achieve our mission and our 2020 strategic impact goal through advocacy. None of this happens, by the way, without the You're the Cure volunteers in our network that take strong positions and become the face of these issues with their elected officials and appointed officials in community states and at the federal level. Volunteers and very skilled and competent staff come together to move these issues forward, and ultimately this will define our success in our 2020 Strategic Impact Goal.